Aircom Pneumatic, the specialist for pressure and volume flow control. Function of the filter pressure regulator. A filter regulator consists of a pressure regulator and a filter combined in one device. The regulator part consists of an adjusting knob, a pressure spring, a diaphragm, and a tappet. The filter part consists of a twist cap, a filter element, a divider, and a drain. The air flows into the filter regulator through the inlet hole, marked dark blue here, and is brought into rotation by the canted wings of the twist cap. This rotation, also referred to as cyclone effect, flings water particles in the air against the filter wall, which then flow down to the container's base. The divider prevents the collected water, referred to as condensate, from being picked up by the airflow again. It divides the filter into a flow zone and a slowdown zone. The condensate collects in the slowdown zone and can be removed from the filter regulator through a drain. The air from which the condensate has been removed now flows through the filter element to remove the remaining dirt particles before arriving at the valve seat of the regulator. By turning the adjusting knob clockwise, the range spring is pre-tensioned, the tappet is pressed downward, and the valve seat is opened. This sets the output pressure set value. The compressed air flows from the input through the filter part and the open tappet to the output, shown here in light blue. Once the actual value matches the set value, the diaphragm is pushed up and the tappet closes the valve seat. The desired output pressure has been reached 